chicken and rice, a hearty and simple dish that is a favorite in this household. Hello everyone and welcome back to my kitchen. Today we are going to be making a dish from my childhood, chicken and rice. It's a super simple recipe with only a few ingredients and it's even better next day. The entire ingredients list is shown on the screen and you can get the full recipe on the channel's website, homestylecookingwithjen.com. Let's get started. First, you want to preheat your oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit or 176 degrees Celsius. Next, in a two quart casserole dish, you want to add your rice, Next, add your water. Then goes in the chicken breasts. Now this recipe can be doubled, tripled, probably even quadrupled with very little effort. Since there's only two in my household, we only need two chicken breasts. The next step is to cover the chicken with the soup. This not only adds flavor, but be sure to spread the soup all over the meat. It acts as a barrier in the oven to keep it from drying out. And while I am playing in the soup, if you're enjoying this video, hit the like button. And if you enjoy recipe videos and the occasional grocery haul, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And don't forget the notification bell. And if you want to see a particular recipe or if you have any questions, leave those in the comments below. Next, I'm just adding a little salt and pepper to add even more flavor to the dish. And now it's time to make Paula Deen proud. Add tabs of butter. You will use the entire stick, of, a half stick of butter, but kind of spot it around the casserole dish to make sure you get good coverage. And the only thing left to do is add foil and pop it into the oven. Now the key to the foil is you want to leave the sides open to vent. I know it sounds weird, but it works. Just very loosely make sure it has enough room to breathe. Then you want to bake it for 45 to 60 minutes and it's done. To plate this, I put two or three scoops of rice in the bottom of a plate, kind of making a bed. Then I slice the chicken and put it on the plate. And yes, I made a mess, so I need to clean it up to make it look all pretty. And that's dinner. I hope everyone stays happy, healthy, and always well-fed.